This is a very good question. Can kidney damage be reversed? Can your kidneys improve once they've started to see deterioration? The answer to this question is very simple. Yes, they can, only if you know what to do. Believe it or not, there are vegetables, herbs, and supplements that you can use to see this happen. So in today's video, I'm gonna reveal what you can do to preserve kidney function and reverse kidney damage all you can, naturally and effectively. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLendivar.com. And this channel is a conventional doctor to have patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to see notifications and be the first one to watch a new video. If you need a line of potent quality supplements for your disease, visit DrLendivar.com and stay till the end of this video. I'm going to share extra tips and video links related to this topic. If you go to the doctor or to a kidney specialist, he'll tell you that kidneys can't reverse the damage they have. Now, in conventional medicine, this is actually true. With the techniques we have, this is not possible. Contrary to what conventional medicine tells us, natural medicine, on the other hand, can help a whole lot. A whole lot more than you think. Let me put it this way. Do you know what you can or cannot eat? or what you can or cannot drink if you have a good or bad kidney health? If you know the answer to these questions, then you're well ahead of the line. So in today's video, I'm gonna be what you can do to preserve kidney function and reverse kidney damage all you can, naturally and effectively. Number one, use parsley juice with a kidney supplement. Parsley is extremely useful for kidney health. You see this simple, Inexpensive, but also a jewel of a vegetable can really help your kidneys improve in their function. Parsley is one of those herbs that everybody knows that can be good for kidney health. The problem is that no one has been able to confirm this until recently. In 2002, the Journal of Ethnopharmacology published a study confirming that parsley was indeed a diuretic, which could be used safely as claimed for years in folk medicine and literature. And it's true. Now, apart from this, popular use has been seen great improvements in kidney function in those who take it daily. I very, I very well encourage you to do so. Now, in the experiment mentioned before, rats were giving parsley seed tea to drink over a 24 hour period. And these rats marked an increased urinary volume and excretion of toxins. Scientists believe that parsley works as a diuretic and has a mechanism to improve kidney function and obviously block the reabsorption of substances like sodium and potassium, improving whatever you have to excrete with a bad kidney function. If you want to use parsley, I suggest you juice on it together with horsetail. Very important. A perfect combination for your kidneys. If you need something natural and effective for this purpose, look for Uri Essence and D Berry from Fineland at DrLandivar.com. Number two, juice on horsetail. You might understand that there's a lot that I can't say in this video about certain herbs and supplements. Now, what I can tell you is that horsetail mixed alongside parsley is one of the best natural home remedies for kidney health and function that you can take. Just so you know, horsetail is a natural diuretic that has the power to improve peripheral edema, basically the retention of water. And it does so without causing electrolyte imbalances like other conventional medications might do. Peripheral edema usually happens when the kidneys are unable to filter out toxins, to filter out waste and liquids from the body. This is when tissues fill up with water, many times caused by a kidney or heart insufficiency, among several other causes, obviously. Now, horsetail helps treat this condition and others by improving water excretion and kidney function. This is very, very important. Very, very important, so listen to it. If you need something natural you can take to improve and prevent kidney conditions that has horsetail, Look for Uri Essence and D Berry from Fineland at DrLandivar.com. Number three, get a hold of the best herbs to improve kidney health and do a kidney cleanse or improve kidney function. Several important herbs have been demonstrated to be useful for kidney cleanses. You might not know about them, but that doesn't mean they don't exist. Some of these, horsetail, uva ursi, dandelion, hawthorn, juniper, and many others. Let's take uva ursi, for example, this plant has played an important role in kidney and urinary health around the world for centuries. And it's proven to be so effective that it's remained a common approach to help urinary tract infections in people with kidney stones and other conditions of all sorts 
that have to do with kidney and water excretion. Now, another very important commonly used herb that I just mentioned before is horsetail. You have hawthorn berries, you have uh, even parsley that you can use at home. There are many others. If you need something natural, a formula that has many, many of the best herbs available for your kidneys, look for Uri Essence from finland at drlandivar.com. I really, really recommend it. Number four, control your blood pressure. Having high blood pressure is one of the most common health conditions that can cause a serious, serious kidney damage. So how is your blood pressure? The problem with blood pressure is that it doesn't really give you any symptoms until your kidneys are already destroyed and you can't wait till that happens. High blood pressure is a silent killer that's frequently seen in health conditions like diabetes, heart disease, high cholesterol levels, etc. You have to be careful. Very common. Now if you have a high blood pressure or a blood pressure meter at home, try to measure your blood pressure every time or every time you can from time to time. A good healthy reading is 120 over 80. If it goes over over that, then obviously you have high blood pressure. I have an entire video on how to lower blood pressure. Very important that you need to keep and you need to see in order to keep your kidneys healthy. If you want to check it out right after this video, it's right over here. If you need something natural that can help you reduce blood pressure, if you have a problem with it and improve circulatory health, look for On Cardio and Heart Excel from Fineland at drlandivar.com. Number five, control your blood sugar. The same thing with blood pressure. Blood sugar is another very important factor for kidney disease, and many people have an insulin resistance. Our OBs have problems with their control, their sugar control, and obviously end up with kidney problems. I really recommend you go and check your sugar levels, first of all. Second, change your diet, make sure you're eating healthy. Third, exercise. Make sure that your diet is not containing genetically modified foods, processed goods, foods that have obviously and have been added with chemicals and toxins and make sure that it's anti-inflammatory that your exercise is well enough for your body to be able to absorb sugar and make sure that you do not have that problem when you see the problem here you have to make sure that you reverse it once and for all before kidney with kidney failure appears or even diabetes if you need something natural that can help you with this specific problem that is a problem for many people around the world look for meta glucose and Appleizer from Fineland at DrLandivar.com. And help out the channel by giving us a thumbs up and share with your friends and family. If you have any questions, leave your comments down below and I'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality supplements for your disease or an online appointment, visit DrLandivar.com and check out these other videos for the two stop and management that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you soon.